was actually 10 p.m. Both boys were also given polygraph tests, which they passed. However, polygraph tests are not always an accurate indicator. Thomas also said that after he last saw Martha that he went inside to work on his report for school on Abraham Lincoln. But when his teachers were questioned, none of them had actually given him an assignment on Abraham Lincoln. Tommy was never charged with anything related to Martha's murder. Now, Rushton Skakel, over at the top over here, really wanted his son's names to be cleared. So he hired a private investigator. However, the private investigator was an honest man and he actually shed more light onto the guilt of the Skakels. Michael Michael had initially said that that night of October 30th, he got back from his cousins at around 11 o'clock p.m. and went straight to bed. But he told the private investigator that he actually went over to Martha Moxley's home, climbed a tree to see into her bedroom window, and masturbated. This is also around the same time where Tommy admitted that the time that he saw Martha last was actually around 10 o'clock p.m., and he also said that they exchanged in mutual masturbation. He actually began to cry as he admitted this.